Can I pick this up? Oh, do we stand? What the hell? What, does that mean that I already have it? That I can just move on? I mean, if that's the case... Okay, okay. Where is... I, I hear it. I hear it very vividly, scuttling. Can I just go? I have a clear line of sight. That's that same one. I feel less threatened because it's being glitchy. Should I feel more threatened? Should I feel less threatened? Am I feeling just about the right amount of threatened? You know what? Alright, this is taking piss ass forever. I'm going. What now? Where? What? I, I didn't even get to this side yet. You're telling me that this motherfucker saw me from that distance. He's gonna beeline it across the river towards me? Don't do this to me, game. I can't see him to judge when I should go. I still don't know whether or not I'm doing the right thing. I'm basing all this off of sound. Didn't they say there's two enemy types? Shouldn't they have thrown the second one at me by now? One can't hear you, the other one can't see. What, are they just puppy guarding base? Do they just have their noises on repeat? I'm gonna have to go at a point. I'll try to stay further away from the noise, I guess. It'd be nice if the foliage was not blinding. Okay, fine, I'll pick you up. I hear running again, though. Thank God you're here. You are the only catharsis that I have. Okay. Am I, like, fucking crazy? Why does it sound like they're just running? Am I gonna look back through this footage saying I'm crazy? My chick is complaining up a storm. She's huffing and puffing. Is that it? Oh, it has it just been stuck there in the rock waiting for me? Is there a second one still? Um, no. Are you gonna move? I'll wait here. Yeah, you know what? You know what? Yeah. You know what? Yeah. I'll fucking wait on you. How about that? Yeah. How about that? Yeah. Yeah. You motherfucker. I swear to God, I can take my headset off and you can't get out of the game. Goddamn great. Goddamn great. Goddamn content creator on YouTube. I'll do what the fuck I want. Okay. Mm. <sighs> okay, okay, okay. Oh god, I put my headphones back on. I can still hear it running. Well, it knows where I am. Yeah, no shit. You stuck? Hey there, monster. You stuck? All the way? Are you stuck all the way? Is there more than one of you? I'm going to just not chance that. Hey there, sexy baby. Um, I want to get such a much up closer look at you, but I'm not going to chance it. I just got back. Oh, I forget what that's called, but it's like, um... It's like cone vision rendering or some shit like that. Yeah, if you see whenever it disappears off the screen, it's because um, the game only tries to load what's directly in front of you within your cone uh, field of view. Cool stuff. Cool stuff. I mean, I do love the game. It's very, very atmospheric. It fits it really well. There's a few key points that I'm like... Eh. But at the same... You make me stop every time. But at the same point in time, I can't really give all of it a pass. I'm glad I got past this part. 
Is there another one? Is there another... Shut up. If there's another one, I hope that it's not hiding directly behind a rock, waiting for me to take a step to get right within its range of hearing, and then it's going to jump out and reset me. That's the only thing. There is no way around this. There is no way to progress forward. I should have just lined the other side of the fence, but, you know, hindsight's twenty twenty. Is there another another one? Is there three in this small area? Are you guys setting me up for failure? Why does my witch have a flashlight? Where is this other one? Can it see me? Can it hear me? Is it, is it currently hearing me? If it's hearing me, does it want me to stop or does it want me to keep going, baby? If you can hear me, audience, do you want me to stop? I'm assuming yes. Because I know I want to. Damn. Okay, I feel like all of the scuttly little spookies are going to be done enough for me to fucking grab whatever I need to from this next area. Mm-hmm. All right, so here I am, the very all right, all right oh, oh. <clears throat> so here I am at the very threshold of the next thing I need to grab. I swear to God, if I get fucking killed as soon as I cross this threshold and have to restart all of that. I'm ripping my own thumbnails off and mailing it to the author of this game. Alright. Stood up a little bit awkwardly there. What you got? So, I don't like the fact that that one disappeared. Because I tried to grab the last one. I've grabbed it before, you see? I've grabbed it before. And when I try to grab this last one, I, um, I didn't see it fucking disappear. So, riddle me this, Batard. Why did this one disappear? Then that one didn't. I hope by everything that is holy that this place does not have three monsters. Okay, wait. This is an open area? Okay, cool. You know what? Fuck it, I'm crawling it. Shut up. Sucks that they buried the same chick over and over. Sounds like it would have been a lot more work. Does this one have working legs? Is this one glitched or broken? Can I pass? Can I go? No? Can I please? It. I'm done asking these questions. I don't need your permission. Well, I do. But I don't know if you're gonna, you know, actually have free mobility. See, the sounds are worthless whenever you hear them coming from every rock. At that moment, sounds do not help you. At that moment, sounds hinder you. What, is there something else? I just, I heard, I, I'm two steps from the fucking log, and I heard another audio cue. What? Uh, I'll go back to crawling. On the ground. Through the forest. I swear to god, I feel like I'm role-playing as a mini version of one of the monsters. Now I got my head a little, little dangly, swingly over here. Yes, yes, I must... I must search all the grass. I really hope that I'm not tone deaf in these headphones. That might be a little unfortunate. But whatever. It doesn't matter anymore. Between audio troubles one day, videos not recording the next, 
I still don't even know what an OBS is. But if it's anything like IBS, I know it's going to be very prominent in my life in the next two years. Mm -hmm. Am I allowed to walk like a regular person, Daddy? Can you please take the collar and leash off? I'm ready to get up and walk like a normal boy. No, no, you don't need to hold my hand anymore. I swear, I'm a big boy. I, can I get up off the ground? I'm getting unaveragely tired. My knees are weak. My arms are heavy. There's nothing on my body already. Mom's spaghetti. Just, yeah, I'm just walking. Fuck it. Oh, hey, it's a different type of corpse. What is that? Here, is there a way to open this? Nice. Are you a female corpse? Oh, how good. What is that? A heart? I hope it was a heart and not a fetus. Pat, pat. Good luck with your nap. I'll go that way. Bye. You can close? Oh, I was hoping that it would close on its own. That would have been creepy. I just shook my fucking headphones. Uh oh. It's the gate. There's only one beside the what? Oh, you sons of fuck. Oh, oh my fucking. I. Oh, uh, it feels like I just hit a fucking wall. Ow, my fucking head hurts. Uh, you know, you know that feeling? That feeling that you get whenever you're running, like, as fast as you can forward? I, I, I'm sorry, I'll take it. I'll take a step back. I'll take a step back and ground myself just a little bit more. You ever have the feeling like you're crawling as fast as you fucking can, and then wham! Right now, fucking wall! Where is this fucking idiot? Can I just run past you now? Are you gonna just scuttle on towards me? How much of this game am I gonna have to cut? Why do no horror games give you the ability to jump? Well, the noises are really not gonna help me out, but I thought that there was one that was scuttling around still. No. No. I'm just gonna chance it. If I die, this will look stupid on footage. You know, whenever you're crawling as fast as you fucking can, and you hit that wall, it feels like your little baby body might have just stopped as hard as it can with a good immense amount of pain, but it feels like your little crawling baby spirit keeps on fucking going in the direction past that goddamn door that I should have been fucking five minutes ago. I've been recording Veneratio Vomitorium for fucking an hour because I am an inept fucking monkey. How do I just the whole gate? Do I just select the whole gate? Okay. Oh. I just hit it three times. Immersive. Please help. I'm trying. There, I've helped you, door. You are now unlocked. You can now remove your graffiti. Oh, is that a stag? Cool. How's it gonna die? Um, the monster's gonna come out from the side of the cornfield, swoop it away. Why did it just give me a full 360, baby? What's happening? I'm not moving. Oh? Okay. So I don't have a jump button. White girl can't jump. Okay. I went through the cornfield assuming that they were going. Ooh. I went through the cornfield assuming that they. Uh, or I guess it's like a wheat field. I went through the. How many times can I, am I going to restart this sentence? It saw me. Didn't it? Yeah, hello. How far back are you going to set me right now? I ain't going to try to outrun it. Those things scuttle pretty quick. It sounds like it's still running up on me. 
I'm starting to choose to think that this is A, part of the music, B, a feature to where they stick them into the terrain half-assed whenever you die, or C, stupid because I can't see anywhere past my fucking face. The music's getting intense. I'm looking around frantically, hoping to see literally anything. Oh my god, this is... This, this is gratuitous. This is fucking gratuitous. I'm done. Gratuitous as fuck. Oh my god. <sighs> I think... I think I need some fucking water. So good and tasty. I honestly am starting to believe that they're just sticking these idiots in the terrain every time that I die. Is that a statue? Is that a monster? I don't know. Oh. Did they just spawn that? Fantastic. Would you look at that? I... I think I'm right. What, were you just pushed into the ground like Leonard, the horse? the fuck's up with you? Why were you just scoping me out, bro? Waiting for me to make a move? Why are you still just spinning around in circles? Uh, I can't be fucking annoyed. I guess... I'm not annoyed, I'm just... My expectations were too high. It's been so long since I went through the horror section on Steam. I haven't honestly been picking up any horror games, psychological horror, or any of those since... Well... Since high school. You know... When the darkness comes was... The cherry that got popped again, so to speak. I used to love games like Soma and Amnesia. I used to love them to death. I was excited to watch, to see how the, um, was it, Alien Isolation. I was excited to see that. I remember when it first came out, it was a bit of a flop. It's kind of funny. It was like, um, supposed to be a really cool game that used the shut up mechanic that I was talking about earlier. Oddly enough. Yeah, um, I'm just slightly disappointed because this is just the free section. I need to shut up. I need to shut up, because this is just the free section, and it is not fair for me to judge them when they are using the resources they have at their disposal. I don't hate this game either, I love it actually. Um, don't take me ranting for anything of that sort, I do like it, it has its rough edges of course, but I'm going to reiterate what can you expect from a free horror game on Steam. Just like we went back and all the rest. I think my mind had a bit of just aggrandizing nostalgia. I remember all those horror games and I, I wanted to have the same experience, but each time that I go through these new ones, I'm that sound. I recognize this melody. You sure sound like it. But I digress. The new experiences I'm making now are just fine by me. And, if you are watching, thank you for exploring these new memories with me as well. Hopefully you can find something funny in something I do.
E. Thank you. You taught me a valuable lesson this time, Venefectium. Thank you so much for joining me in this entire endeavor. I'm sorry if any of it seemed a bit weird. I'm still trying to figure out where my own mind stands. I just want to share this entire journey with every single one of you that decides to stop on by. Speaking of stopping on by, if you could do me a huge favor and go stop on by Lyle Wrath. He's fucking great. His spoiler alerts are always going to be my favorite. I hope that you have a wonderful day today, tomorrow, and the next. I can't wait to see you again. And let me know if there's anything that you ever need from me. Have a good day.